Hey guys, welcome to another episode of What's Hot. We have a return of Roger here. I'm back. It's been a little bit, but... It has. All right, you want to start into something? I do. So, let's jump into beer, just because it's right here in front of me, and yes. it's delicious. Um, so, we have this IPA survival kit. comes with four different IPAs, three cans each. We'll make your 12-pack. Um, just something if you want to try a few different things, figure out which one you like, um, or maybe you like all four of them and just want a little variety. So, there you go. Yep from Terrapin, Terrapin Beer Company. It has an American IPA, a Pog IPA, local IPA, and a cryo hopped IPA. Sounds delicious. Mm -hmm. I have no idea what that means. But I don't it either, but good. it's good. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Uh, I guess let's start in. We have some new Benchmades yeah. here. Uh, everybody knows the, the bug out, the lightweight, um, thin. Now they have the new bailout. has an icebreaker on, or uh, um, glass a break. glass breaker on the back. The Tonto style blade. Super light, thin, um, very smooth, very nice. Um, I actually own the regular bug out. Uh, I love it. I'm thinking about picking this one up just because it's a great little knife here. Lightweight. And then we have the new mini bug out, which is nice for those people that like the smaller um, pocket knives, lightweight. This one's in a blazed orange color, which is really nice because I like to lose knives. You yeah. can drop it in the drop woods, in the if woods. You're, you can see it as mm -hmm. opposed to a green knife. Um, but uh, it's great, nice and lightweight, just like the other ones. Um, it's just going to be a great knife all around. Mm -hmm. All right, what do we have next, Roger? So let's go. I want to save the lures for last. Cause yeah, because they're fantastic. Exciting. So we'll go to some clothing. We have these new Tormentor um, long sleeve shirts in they are textile spf 50 um and they're only 26.99 so hot deal yeah really good deal usually these things are around 40 50 bucks and they um, have great graphics yeah really good graphics. really good graphics i'm excited about these i'm gonna take a few home tonight do you really no <laughs> but i will not yet <laughs> All right, I guess we'll go into some Mr. Twisters. Yeah, let's see that. All right, so we have some new plastics here, Mr. Twister. They are gonna be the regular six twister inch. tail, six inch. Um, good for largemouth bass. You can use it for snakeheads. We have a good clear chartreuse, white. white. And then we have some four inches. Four inch uh, little twister tails here with the black with the chartreuse tail. It's gonna be good for snakehead. Um, and then the red with the white tail. And then we also have the green pumpkin buzz, buzz bug, bug. Mm -hmm. it's gonna be a great snakehead large mouth large bass mouth. small mouth yeah. anything it's gonna be great you can net rig, rig it yeah yep. <laughs> um drop shot you can do whatever you want with it put it on a jig it's gonna be great these have nice little appendages here you're gonna flap like crazy it's gonna yep. be a great one a on oh yeah all right what do we have next so while we're talking about plastics the uh the pleasure shads from pleasure 13 fishing shad. um they smell terrible, but <laughs> in, a good way. in a good way, yeah. They have what's called donkey sauce, <laughs> donkey sauce on is what them. They call it. This one is Mardi Craw. We got black and tan. And then we got collard greens. Mm -hmm. mm. So just, yeah, nice four and a half inch paddle tails. It's really nice. They're made to, when you're reeling them, they don't actually roll over like other um, um, yeah, paddle yeah. tails can. Sometimes you reel them quick enough, they'll end roll up side down but these are really nice great size for snakehead yeah, rockfish, rockfish anything yeah. you want nice like big this. fat thick boot tail on the back of it it's gonna be a good one yep can't wait to try those out um moving on to another 13 fishing product we have the joystick rabbit rabbit, rabbit ear, ear tail. tail it's naturally buoyant yeah. also infused with donkey sauce yeah this one smells even better <laughs> <laughs> great color um, it's going to be great for it. You can Ned rig yeah, it. Ned, you can um, drop shot. You can just throw it on a Texas rig. It's going to be great. I love this a lot. I love these style baits. It's like a mix between a Sanko and a, a fluke or like something. They, they float too, yeah, right? So, so it's going to be going to stand straight up. Yeah, it's going to be great. They have these little tiny um, kicker tails here. So it's going to give it some nice subtle action. Um, great color. This one's the OG Sour. OG Sour. It's always a good one. Mm -hmm. So. Can't wait to try those out as well. Moving on to, I guess, some, some line here. Four carbon. We have a new line, no pun intended, new line new of line. line. Uh, we got the new J Fluoro um, from uh, Daiwa. So it's gonna be the Samurai, Samurai fluorocarbon. They come in, we carry the five, seven, 10, um, 14, 18, I think 22 pound. The nice part about the this line 
is it actually comes with a sticker that marks the half spool. So how many times you guys spool a reel up right. and then you're like, oh, I got plenty of line left on there and you realize you don't you have don't enough have and it's enough. terrible. Yeah. But that's a great idea. The line is super nice. It's not like other fluoros. It's not super stiff. It's actually a nice, really, just really yeah, they're 220 Supple. yard spools. Too. Yeah, which is a lot. So, and yeah. it has, it's nice because it comes with a line holder on it. So you pull off, it just goes with it. So you're not having to worry about line. Just, oh, that's fantastic. Yes, the best thing in the world. That so it doesn't fantastic. just coil off and coil off and you lose hundreds of yards yeah. just because it's annoying. But look at that. Look Little at that. Things. Look at that. Little things in life just make you so happy. Very and happy. that makes me very happy. And you can just kind of wind, well, yep. cool. just wind it back on. So. I guess next. Yeah, more 13 fishing. More 13 fishing. We have the spin walker. So this is going to be a uh, top water bait, floats, and then uh, just kind of walk the dog style. But then you also get this little spinner clacker in the back. So it's um, like a mix between a, a spook, a um, buzz bait, and yes. Yeah. <laughs> Great color patterns. Yeah. Um, I think it's, it's like a bone, bone color. That looks like a hot bluegill color and then a natural shad pattern. Yeah. Um, great colors there, really strong knife hooks, um, like very, very sharp, yeah. insanely sharp. That's the one thing about 13 Fishing, they put great components on their lures. Um, another one from 13 Fishing, the Jabber Jaw. Look at that hot yeah, this color. Is kind of cool. I've never seen so it's like a mix that. between a crankbait and a chatterbait. So the the bill of it has it wobbles around, so it acts like a chatterbait. So it's going to kick all around. Um, once again, nice sharp hooks. That color pattern is a great yeah, crawl I pattern. Like I like the more matte finish. They I feel like they look a lot more natural. Um, metal bill, so you're not going to worry about snapping it off. Yep. I've broken a lot of uh, crankbaits by throwing them against rocks. Yep. Um, but it's going to be a great one. It's going to give you a ton of action. I can't wait to try these out it's going to be phenomenal and then last but not least we have the uh blade bait by rapala um yeah these are new here phenomenal yeah they have a nice rattle in them they have a metal um fin on the top and bottom so it's going to be like a rag standard blade bait the uh, line clip up top so you can reel them like a rattle trap you can rip them up you can what's called yo 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 pull them up um the best the part about these, yeah. the front hook. It only has a double hook on the front. So as you can see, it runs over structure. It's not going to get snagged. Get snagged how many people like to just get rattle traps and cut the front hook off? This is already done for you. Yep. Great color patterns. That metallic -y purple, great. Mm -hmm. Just looks really good. Give off a lot of shine. Oh, yeah. Great for yeah. snakeheads, rockfish. I'm sure... I can almost guarantee you can probably catch ginormous Sorry, perch on these around rip wrap yeah, in the shallows. Definitely. They're going to be great. Um, good weight. I don't know how much they weigh. Half, Half ounce. Yeah. So you're going to be able to wing these. These are going to be great for mackerel um, oh, and those yeah. schoolies. Uh, schoolie rockfish, bluefish. Blue they're going to be yeah. phenomenal. I can't wait to throw these out and catch some mackies on those. Mm -hmm. um, I think it's going to do it for what's yeah. hard this week. Um, we'll see you next yeah, week. Thank you. Thank you for tuning in.